Nashville. We are starting this morning on some rain showers moving through parts of our area right now and even a few thunderstorms uh, across the area this morning. So here's how our Monday planner is going to go for you today. This morning we're going to see some still some area rain and even a few sh uh, scattered showers and thunderstorms. We'll see 65 degrees for you this morning. Temperatures will warm up though as we work our way towards this afternoon. Uh, we'll see some scattered showers, a few storms, and some of those could be on the strong side. We'll get a break, uh, a little bit of a break in the afternoon before more uh, rain tries to build back in uh, later on this evening for you. But our high today will be right around 83 degrees where we will see some more uh, warm and stray storms for you this afternoon towards the 3, 4 o'clock hour. But again, we're going to watch this very very carefully for you so make sure you tune in right to us so again that outlook we've got two waves of some strong and severe storms the first wave will come uh, tonight between 11 p.m. also by uh, into seven o'clock tomorrow morning so Tuesday morning here now here's the the color code of this so if you're in uh, some of our northwestern uh, Kentucky counties and a little bit of our Tennessee counties you're under an enhanced risk most of that is on up towards the Kentucky area but there is a county uh, down here in Tennessee that is uh, just a little bit uh, in that enhanced risk but for majority of us here in Middle Tennessee uh, Montgomery Dixon County Cheatham County Robertson County Sumner County Macon County uh, Stewart Humphreys County you are under that slight risk which is a category two out of five for severe weather an enhanced risk is a three out of five and then you scoop down uh, south of Nashville towards Franklin Columbia Waynesboro Murfreesboro Shelbyville McMin McMinnville excuse me Carthage Jamestown Crossville all of those areas are under a marginal risk for uh, which is that's just a category one out of five and that's a five percent chance of seeing some strong to severe storms and that is the severe weather outlook for today uh, for 11 p.m. to 7 a.m. and then uh, if you scoot down towards Lawrenceburg uh, Giles County just a general thunderstorm for you and that is just a, it's not on the scale it is on the scale, but it's not uh, between the level one out of five. It's the lowest, lowest on the scale. But still, don't really pay attention to the color codes because anybody could see a strong to severe storm today or and overnight tonight into Tuesday. So don't pay attention to the color codes. It's about uh, your safety, and it is our priority to keep you safe. So our hazardous level, we could see uh, some isolated tornadoes. It cannot be ruled out. That's why we say it is never zero. It's on the low side, but it's never zero. Always remember that. Damaging winds, over 60 mile per hour winds, that's going to be one of our primary concerns. Our second primary concern will be large hail. Uh, we could see uh, some hail uh, over maybe a, an, an inch uh, in diameter diameter that could occur uh, in some spots so where we see some of these stronger storms develop we could see some uh, some very uh, hail large hail uh, included localized flooding is also possible with all the rain coming down at once uh, it, it, it could uh, the river streams and creeks all that could struggle to keep all that water in so we could see some little bit of a localized flooding not a widespread flooding but we could still see some localized flooding across the area our severe outlook for tomorrow, uh, this is wave two, which will be from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. The National Weather Service has majority of Middle Tennessee under a slight risk. If you are south of Nashville, you are under an enhanced risk. So Sumner County, Davidson County, Robertson, Cheatham, Wilson County, Carthage, uh, Jamestown, Crossville, Salina, Williamson, uh, Wilson, I'm sorry, Wilson County, uh, Putnam County as well, Williamson. All of those areas are under a slight risk, which is a category two out of five. That is a 15% chance of seeing some uh, one or two strong to severe storms. Areas south of Nashville, south of Interstate 40, Franklin, Columbia, Waynesboro, Lawrenceburg, Shelbyville, Bedford County, Lawrence, Giles County, all of those areas are under a cat three out of five. That is a 30% chance of seeing some strong to severe storms. The hazardous level with it 
We could see tornadoes. Again, damaging winds over 60 miles per hour will be possible. Large hail and also localized flooding will also be possible. So what are our storm threats? The hail is on the medium side. Just want to re, re uh, enact this for you. Hail is a medium. Flooding is uh, is uh, is uh, on the low side. We can see some localized flooding, but that is on the low side. Winds are medium, so we uh, hail and winds are going to be our top two primary concerns. And then tornadoes is also on the medium side because we saw a lot of quick spin up tornadoes across the area for you uh, this morning. We had one for Marshall and Murray County this morning, and then we had one uh, that. They issued one for Cannon in Rutherford County, but it quickly um, expired. So we got to stay weather aware with that. So Storm 12 Alert is in effect for today and tomorrow. Um, 83 degrees today, 80 tomorrow. We dry out for Wednesday and Thursday and Friday with just a little bit of a two and ten, uh, uh, two and ten shot of rain, just a 20% chance of rain for Thursday, Friday. More rain comes back into the forecast for Saturday and for Sunday. I'm meteorologist Laurente Barbie. Enjoy the rest of your Monday morning.